Previously on Ween Plays, Don't Starve. Yeah, there's some north of the camp, I suppose. I don't see any manure just chilling out here. Sadly. I do love that this game uses manure in the way it does, and that you find yourself actually wanting to have it. <laughs> to have good quantities of manure on you at all times. Well, after running around a little bit, we got the manure we needed, so let's cruise on down here. Now, I think, and it does look like it, this tree is probably going to be in the way. Let's go ahead and chop this guy down. Right when I had put it down originally, I thought, oh man, I shouldn't have done that. Kind of blocking my next farm. Not, not that I have to do a farm right here, but in fact, if I still can't get it there, we'll just go beside the other one. Ten grass, aww. That is something I definitely don't have. Hmm. In fact, I have zero grass. Ugh. <sighs> well. Hmm. Sun's gonna go down, so we're not gonna go hunting for grass just yet. I guess that's something we will consider in the morning. Well, day 19. Here we go. I am chopping trees, obviously. Made an axe. I've got part of another one going. I think what we're gonna do is clear these trees out while I kind of consider the option. So I have a log suit and a spear so we can go after beefalo. This is something I've kind of thought out loud about before and uh, possibly set up another camp, but maybe what it would be is just a beefalo run to kill some beefalo, camp overnight, and cruise back down here. I don't like the idea of splitting the camps just yet. We're still kind of in a fragile state. Food's getting kind of low. So I think what we'll do is we'll stick here and in that case, I can make another farm. Well, I will need seeds. I got one seed. So with another farm, we'll have three. We can kind of keep feeding those. Um, so that's kind of good. We, do, we definitely need to be building on the food. And I really need to get around to um, fertilizing a lot of this stuff. Now, I did have a bunch of the grass come in last night. That was really cool. Um, I do need to get a bunch of that going, I believe in order to get the uh, farm going. Let's see. Yeah, we need 10 grass. So now we only need three. We had seven come through last night. So I think we'll go get that now, now that this is all chopped up. Let's go ahead and get some grass. And I, I know I took a bunch of it out. It looks like there's big chunks of it down this way. We'll do that. We'll throw a farm down. That'll be good. Because food is definitely becoming an issue. Another good thing about running up and going after beefalo is that I can get all the manure I can while I'm up there. Which definitely would be helpful right now. Because I could rapidly just kind of plant seeds and uh, fertilize it, you know, all the way up and, and have it immediately and start building up a good uh, store of food. Seeds are going to be a big part of that. Those will be easy enough to get on the way up as well. So I'm kind of, I'm kind of leaning that way. I'm kind of leaning towards cruising up and getting at the buffalo, or the beefalo, I should say. Um, the meat, obviously, would be great, but especially so I can make, make a meat effigy, and we can... If you watch my series before, especially the long-running series, you know that I just, ah, I breathe like a sigh of relief with the meat effigy down. It's just kind of like, all right, I can relax, you know, even if just a little bit, I can uh, definitely kind of take in a breath and, and slow things down a bit, so... We'll go ahead and plant these guys. Let's see. We'll go ahead and throw this guy down if it'll do it. Looks like it will. So we got those lined up. Now only had the two seeds. So we'll just take a quick run out here and see if we can't find another. Maybe not. I wonder if I can corner the uh, butterfly. Oh, look at that! I got him. Okay. This guy probably not so easy. Okay, well anyway, I suppose I can plant him now and that's a flower, but I think, or at least I thought you could. Hmm, he's a dead butterfly, right? Oh, butterfly wings, interesting. Oh right, you have to catch that guy, I believe. Anyway, I'm kind of rambling, I know, I know I'm thinking out loud. You see how easily I'm distracted? Yes, okay, so, where are we at? We are desperately low on food, let's go ahead and eat something. Let's go ahead and cook, um... 
I could cook two of those with honey. I guess that's... Hmm. I think what I'm gonna have to do is get a little desperate here and, and uh, just cook this straight up. Come on. Uh, fine, just put it down. Let's go! <laughs> get on it. I'm gonna eat these seeds. Okay. This is definitely, definitely not good. Let's, um... Let's throw... We'll put two meat and two honey into the uh, deal. I looked in with the bee. Uh, as far as the bee box goes, I just need the honeycomb. So I realized I could actually use these as food and not worry about it. I was kind of saving them, thinking I need them for the bee box. But that is not the case. So we've got that going. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and pick this up. and Let's think. Let's think good and hard about that beefalo run. Day 20. Not too shabby, right? So what I'm going to do today is actually just kind of jet out and we are going to hunt some spiders, but not only that, we're actually going to do some exploring just a little bit. And I do need a couple grass um, because I want to be able to make a torch. So we're just a couple shy of that, so there we go. Let's go ahead and make that. Oh, I just realized I had a torch right as I made it. Bummer. Okay, well, we'll just ditch it here and maybe I'll pick it up on the way back. Um, basically, we're going to... Although, come to think of it... I was going to burn the spider's nest up here, but I'm not sure that, that actually does much. Last time I did, it didn't seem very effective in that way. And we will grab flowers because, as you can see, the hat is not in the best of shape, so... Let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to cruise up here. Now I chose this spider because I thought I would kind of explore this uh, area that I haven't seen. And as I was kind of guessing, it looks like it doesn't really go very far. So let's see. Here to there. Let's go ahead and take this out. And we'll start a fire and then we're going to kind of run. Um, where's the torch out? There we go. Okay, let's get out of here. Switch to the spear. Okay, it looks like they want to sleep more than they want to do anything else. And they want to die, which works. I don't know if it burns any of the stuff they're dropping. I really hope it doesn't. That's not something I was thinking of because of the uh, forest fire, but it looks like that's not going to be an issue. Looks like he's going to chase me, though. Yep. Alright. Oops. Oh, I'm clicking the tree. It's no good. There we go. Okay, we have spider webs. Now, I was really hoping to get three of these, so yes, there we go. And now we know where to go if I need some charcoal. <laughs> okay, in fact, there's a stone up there. I might go bust that up. So let's see, we're going to have to choose some things. I already have a bunch of these berry bushes, so we're just going to go ahead and ditch those. Cool, we have three webs. Now, what I was looking at making was the... Um, Let's see where to go. The bug net. And yeah, it looks like we're going to be able to do that. Once we grab up some grass, we should be good to go. Um, let's go ahead and drop... Uh, actually, we can just eat these. Seeds. Looks like I'll have to drop something else. I don't really need the pine cones, right? Whatever those are. Pine cones, yes. Hey, I, all of a sudden I thought maybe they called him something else, but apparently not. Okay, so... Let's see, we can now make the net, which is really cool because we can swoop up bees. So I think that what I need to do, and I could grab this torch if I wanted to. Let's see. Um, no, let's go ahead and just leave it. Actually, let's ditch the hat. Still doesn't help me, but I suppose. <laughs> but um, yeah, we're going to be able to, I think, I think we're going to be able to make the um, bee box. I do want to carry grass. Hmm. 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 Fine. We'll eat the seeds. Seeds are good, right? Sunflower seeds. Okay. Bee box would be great. Hello, your majesty. Let me just pick this grass out here. Excellent. Okay. Now. Bee box, let's see, where's the bee box at? Is it in the food? I never recall. 
Day 21. Well, day 21 finds me hunting for food, but also I made the net last night. So we're, we're going to keep an eye out and probably swing near the uh, bees and see if we can't swoop some. I just need uh, four of them and we can make a bee box. I think I pretty much have everything else. So that is the plan. Let's go ahead and cruise. Let's see. Um, there was one up this way, but I busted it down. So let's cruise down this way where we've got a number of them. Now, I don't know if killer bees count. I don't know if they count as far as uh, making a bee box or not. I believe it shows a yellow, kind of a standard bee when it comes to the ingredients of a bee box. But um, I guess they're all out, so I'll have to uh, see if I can't find them. Here we go, buzzing around. Swooped. And I'm quite hungry, so let's go ahead and, I know it's not cooked, right? But just, we'll do one. Okay. Alrighty. What do we got? We got five there. Is, is it going to keep kicking bees out? <laughs> okay. Certainly need some food, so I'm not going to pass it up while I'm out here. In fact, it looks like there's a bunch of um, berry bushes over here, so let's go ahead and clear this out. So I may have to eat one more. Might have to do one more. We'll just probably go ahead and do it now. Cool. We've eaten. We are gathering. Ooh, a whole bunch of berries out here. Okay, let's go ahead and cruise back. And we'll hit up some flowers on the way back. Uh, what, what am I at? Nine. So I just need three more. And I can make, uh, basically, have enough set aside for a new hat. In fact, um, I think I need a new hat, come to think of it. I thought maybe I had it stored away, but I actually think that I may not have one at all. Let's go ahead and cruise back. Look at all these bees now. I was just looking for some. We have six. Okay. Camp. Northbound. Let's get up here. We are starving. Let's not die from that, right? We have food crops up. That's good. Um, let's go ahead and, in fact, we're going to kind of grab some of these and just get something going. We've got, obviously, have berries. Let's go ahead and do those. Cool. We got something cooking. That guy's growing. We'll drop some things in here, like this. Keep the seed. Actually, let's plant some real quick. So, let's look into a bee box, shall we? Was, that was the plan, right? Um, sorry, interrupted by hunger pangs. Okay. Let's see this. Uh, bee box. Where is the bee box? I always forget. Oh, where's the bee box? None of these, right? Mm-hmm. So, we just need two boards. Quite easy. There we go. Uh, oh, moved up. <laughs> I got a little thrown off. Cool. Alrighty, we got the bee box. So let's go ahead and stick this uh, eh, out here somewhere. That'll work. Now, hopefully, I'm I'm not sure if there ends up being killer bees in this. I really hope not. But um, yeah, that's that's gonna be good. We'll get some honey. And like I said a while back, the great thing about honey is we can turn that into taffy, which heals like 20 of your uh, sanity. So it's very cool. Very helpful. Alright, well I thought I'd interrupt the night with a little bit of experimenting. And I just made a pitchfork. Uh, there it is. And what we're going to do is I tried to... I made some wood flooring and I thought, you know... I'm assuming that's okay by a fire. The contained fire as it is, you know, should be fine. But, um... So I wanted to actually place some down. Because I, I have a feeling it might help with your sanity level. <laughs> if you're not you know directly on the ground but um, I'm not entirely sure of that so 
Anyway, I thought I would just kind of make one section of it and try to put it down. It says I can't, so um, I think that's because I need to dig this out. You can't do that. So we'll go ahead and use the pitchfork and dig a spot out. Cool. And now we'll try to place it down. There we go. So we've got some wood flooring here. So I'm not sure, like I said, I don't know if that really helps uh, with the sanity meter, if that's just kind of for looks. No clue. But um, I thought I'd give it a try. Looks cool. So that's all. Just wanted to interrupt the night with that <laughs> little experiment. So, oh, well, what do you know? We're here in the morning. Now, I could dig a bunch more of this out and everything, um, but I don't want to really kind of mow through my wood yet just to do that. I am going to want to put walls up. And I have a feeling being surrounded with so many trees that wood might be the way to go. Stone would be nice, but all the stone is way up there. <laughs> so uh, as far as I know, there's not any more nearby. It would take a lot of exploring. Whereas wood, nah, there's a lot of wood here. So anyway, that's probably what we'll do when the time comes. I mean, right now we're so focused on keeping the food going that um, that is kind of a low priority. But um, let's see, speaking of food, let's go ahead and get the next thing going here. Maybe some of that with the meat. Okay, and I definitely need to eat something. Let's go ahead and eat something big. Although that didn't help a whole lot. It's better if it has meat, so this next meal should be a lot better. And um, yeah, I think I basically need to offload a bunch of the stuff that I've got here. Uh, so I'm carrying around a lot of things I really don't need to be carrying around anymore, so it's time to organize things. Hmm, I do hear that. <laughs> there are hounds nearby. I've got things pretty well organized at this point. I'm just kind of moving things around a bit now. I made a second chest here, as you can see. I definitely was running out of room. And, um, yeah, I hear hounds. So what we're going to do is we're going to kind of head towards the pigs. I don't want to have this problem during the night, so I'm hoping I can find them. Last time one was up here. Hopefully I can find these guys pretty quick and just get the pigs on it. They're on duty, on patrol. But uh, I don't know if we'll get that lucky. Running over to the pigs at night obviously isn't of much help. They tend to sleep. What I could do is I could actually feed one or two of them right now. Although, I have a hard enough time feeding myself. <laughs> so maybe that's not what we'll do. But um, there we go. There's a hound. So that's good. Let's run you over. Yep. Ooh, more. Excellent. Oh, boy. Oh, this is a Bernie kind of one, too. A fiery guy. Alrighty. Let's get rid of the weapon and try to get pick up any leftovers. Yep. Oh, they ate it, his butt right away. <laughs> Come on. Right this way. There you go. Get on it, guys. Okay. Whoa, no. Nope. Not me. There you go. I want that. Oh, fire. Where'd the food go? Can I pick it up? Looks like I did. Kill him. You got him. That's my meat. My meat. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, what do we get? We got two pieces of meat. I guess that'll work. Just as the sun's going down, so... Not too bad. Thank you, hounds. I appreciate your attacks.